Here is a collection of my latest designs which are nearly ready to be open sourced. I've been putting regular updates on Instagram, so go follow me there. Most of these designs are aimed at finding my ideal robot actuator for a quadruped robot or a robot arm. Some projects are just for the kids. I am nearly over cycloidal gearboxes and have been intrigued by capstan or winch drives that have been popping up on a few discords. If you would like a particular design, let me know and I'll put it up on Thingiverse and create an in-depth YouTube video. This is my favourite new design. The brushless motor goes inside the dual capstan output housing with the timing belt providing an extra gear reduction. This is the same as the previous design, but has a NEMA 17 stepper inside. This is an update of my very first quad with elastic joints because I was stripping servo gears. It uses high voltage servos with a direct connection to the ESP32, which keeps wiring and electronics neat. Gus Simpson drives are very interesting and I just wanted to see how they work. I'm still trying to make cycloids better. This dual stage doesn't wobble, is 240 to 1, has high torque and is directly connected to a NEMA 17 stepper. This was a fun project to do with my daughter after she got annoyed at the rigged time zone games. The differential timing belt system may have potential, I just have to make it for real. This mini quad uses high voltage, high speed, expensive mini servos from a previous project. It uses ESP32 for a Bluetooth link to the PC. My first capstan drive is very smooth but has a low reduction ratio and is a bit bulky. Combine capstans, Gus Simpson drives and differential pulleys and this is what you get. Not sure if it'll work. Gradual improvements of the existing quadruped has ended up with the triple disc cycloidal gearbox. Easy to print and assemble.
All of these designs should be open sourced over the holiday break.